Every now and then the world changes because we make a huge discovery. In the beginning, we only believed what we could see. So we thought the world was flat and people could fall off the edge. Then we discovered the world was round and we still didn't understand why people didn't fall off. But scientists knew there was a law called gravity. Next we discovered the world was made of atoms, but we couldn't understand why everything looked so real. So the scientists split an atom to look inside. And what they found was enormous amounts of power. So if we are made of atoms, where's our power? Because we need this power if we're going to be creative. A long time ago we had no power unless we had royal blood. We could only express ourselves creatively by killing or having babies. Then a revolution happened. This time we had no power unless we had money. So we expressed ourselves creatively by making money or marrying the money. Mm. So we know the power is inside us somewhere, but we can't seem to find it. Why? Because like gravity, we still don't trust things we can't see. So let's give it a shape. Power has a masculine and feminine element and three directions it can move. To be creative, it has to move forward, but it can also move against or away from. Old-fashioned creativity involved a lot of competition to be the best. A few people got to be creative dons, but the need to win can result in a bad attitude or a destructive indulgence. This kind of creativity made money for a while, but the dynamic of competition and withdrawal is unsustainable, so eventually leads to burnout. Luckily, we're now entering a new paradigm where we have the potential for genius levels of creativity. If only we can move forward together. We know there's high voltage energy available for this because the mystics have experienced it. But it requires collaboration. Creativity of the future won't be about learning a skill. It'll be about learning to manage and direct this energy. It won't be about competing. It'll be about collaborating. The world is changing again. It's time to get ready for the shift.